Boy, I love this training session for indoor training because it addresses a problem that I think everyone has in some degree, even tour players have this problem that sometimes they bring the putter back too far and they kind of decelerate it in and they don't, we even hear commentators talk about that, that it's tr too long and they decel in. The opposite happens sometimes as well where we don't bring it back far enough and then we kind of pop it and our speed control just goes down the drain. Now, here's the challenge with that is how do I therefore train my stroke to, to not decel or train it to, to have a good follow through. And the answer to that it was found in eighth grade when you and I did the experiment where we put our arms in that door jam and we pressed out and then when we got out of the door jam, our arms kind of lifted. Well, what happened was we activated some muscles and we deactivated some muscles. Eventually they came back and came back to where they're supposed to. You can do this experiment that we're gonna do. We've got a product that we call the memory band system, which does exactly that. And you can try it in the door jam. So here's the idea. If I'm trying to train a, a stroke that I, that I want to bring through with some authority that eliminate the D cell, all I do is take and, and train it against the resistance of going forward. Now here's the key. You gotta hang on to it for 30 seconds. 30 seconds, I'm not gonna do it in the video, but you gotta hang on to it for 30 seconds, bring it back, release, shake, back to 30, do that three times. So it's 90 seconds of, of tension with a little bit of break in between. But what will happen is that I will probably not bring it back very far and I will bring it through with a lot of authority because my muscles are going toward where that tension was. It's phenomenal. The same thing happens in reverse. If I'm trying to train a stroke that goes back and not that pop stroke, I'm gonna bring it back and I'm gonna hold it for 30 and then for 30 and then for 30. And I bring it back, it's gonna to wanna to come back and come through with less uh, chase is what I call it. You can try this in the door jam because I want you to feel that experience. The difference between the door jam and the memory band is that with the memory band, we are on path and we're on plane, right? and we know how far we're bringing it back, the putter's moving in the proper method, our shoulders are engaging in the proper rotation, and what ends up happening is we're developing a stroke that's on plane, on path, with the proper kind of, uh, of changes that my brain is engaging. I move toward where that tension was. When you do that, you're gonna develop a stroke that has plenty of authority, stays within the boundaries of not too far back, not too far through. This is a phenomenal drill. Invest five minutes a day for the next month, you will be in shock what happens to your putting this spring?